With the year completed, it's a great opportunity to look at some of the trends that were driving the Canadian capital markets during 2017. One thing people will remember about 2017 was it was a very robust year for new listings. In total, we had 142 new corporate listings on the TSX and the TSX Venture Exchange. 44 were on Toronto Stock Exchange and 98 on the TSX Venture Exchange. This included 28 IPOs, it included 38 qualifying transactions, and 15 companies that graduated from the TSX Venture Exchange to the Toronto Stock Exchange. In total, this represented greater than a 30% increase in new corporate listings during 2017. Another milestone that our markets reached during 2017 related to the total market capitalization for the TSX and the TSX Venture Exchange. At the end of the year, December 31st, 2017, the total market capitalization for the Canadian capital markets closed at over $3 trillion. This is the first year in our history where our total market capitalization ended the year at over $3 trillion. Another trend around market capitalization relates specifically to the, Toronto, the TSX Venture Exchange. The Venture Exchange during the year 2017 increased its total market capitalization by 33%. The final thing we wanted to highlight in this review of 2017 was the IPO market. As we mentioned earlier, there were 28 IPOs this year. These IPOs raised over $4.9 billion in 2017, representing an increase of, over, of more than 500% in total IPO capital raised compared to last year. But as important as the total amount of capital raised by IPOs, from our perspective, is also the diversity of the companies that came to market. Through the TSX and the TSX Venture Exchange, investors get access to Canadian companies and growth sectors of the Canadian economy. This year, we saw consumer brands like Canada Goose and Roots, energy companies like Step, Source, and Kinder Morgan, innovation companies like Real Matters and Zymeworks. We also saw industrial companies like Stelco and materials companies like Neo Materials. On the mining side, we saw international companies coming to this market, companies like Nexa Resources and Eero Copper. And we saw very significant interlistings coming to TSX and TSX Venture Exchange from other international markets. Overall, 2017 will be remembered as a very robust year for new listings.